first of all, Halloween Pass has dropped, and today we're gonna do a Ike scheduling, sched scheduling hardcore telegram missions. Why? Because it's three times gold, money, and XP. We're gonna do a special mission which I found out to be quite simple, which is strong medicine from you know the Ike Ike scheduling mission. So you're gonna select that, and we're gonna I'm gonna talk you through on uh, what you need to do on this mission because it's quite simple actually uh first of all you're gonna need a bow all right you're gonna need a bow anytime any type of bow the normal bow or the improved bow just as long as it's silent and you can shoot it from a distance it's gonna be fine also if you like to go like very up close and personal you could use a knife tomahawk or whatever just don't use the Molotovs or dynamite or else you're gonna you know f make the whole thing a lot harder on you so right here at the end of this fence he's gonna dismount you, you want to dismount with him and equip a bow and then you're gonna be shooting the enemies from this spot because I found it to be you know good you can take out every single enemy from here and you know you, you keep a distance because for some reason I think the bow makes some sound and you know I don't want to risk it so you wanna first shoot this guy closest to you because he has it he has the his back turned on you so it's gonna be a quick easy kill next is gonna be so next is gonna be that guy then it's gonna be the guy that's going back and forth uh, behind those boxes. Then it's gonna be the guy on the left, and finally the guy on the center. Uh, make sure to have your dead eye completely full, because you're not gonna be using that eye in this mission quite a lot. Make things easier. Makes it, you know, the enemies highlight like this. You shoot this guy, and then you shoot the guy a little bit down the ways and then you're gonna shoot that guy on the head there you go and then you're gonna shoot this guy on the head there you go so here you want to take out the high ground right here right behind us house and uh, because the reason I the reason why is gonna be a guy spawning there I mean you can ignore him but you know I like my XP I like getting kills with the bow working on that um, uh, bow buckle so like the arrow I didn't mean to get on the horse I want to loot the body there you go and then you're gonna keep moving you're gonna go up the road to this little encampment right here there's gonna be one enemy taking care of the horses you're gonna take him out first you just climb on the rock there you go because you need a good vantage point you're gonna shoot him in the head like so then you're gonna need to take out the enemy on the 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 farthest enemy which is the one on uh, the right side right there you're gonna need to take that guy out then you're gonna take that guy then you're gonna take that guy out and then there's one guy going behind the fences but we're gonna take care of them later so now you need to make sure to headshot this guy because if you miss it's gonna mess the whole thing up so make sure you aim for the head like so then you're gonna take out this guy there you go uh, the other guy you need to get in close because if you shoot him with an arrow his body is gonna spot him before you can take him out so it's best to just uh, crouch walk behind him and just stab him with a bow or knife or whatever you wanna you wanna do and mindful that they're always gonna have your the their backs turned on you so it's it's quite it's just it's really easy to go stealth on this mission there you go stabbed and then just to make sure gonna kill him and loot the body 
Now, there's six guys in this um, area, and the last guy is behind the uh, stable where we shot the first guy. He's like two stables away from him, so you just take him out, and this section is clear. Alright, so this next section is gonna be the saloon section, which is quite easy. You, you just it's really easy. You, 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 there's no way you can you can mess this up. So you're gonna enter the cafe, saloon, whatever from this side door. There's gonna be one guy straight ahead, one guy to the left. There you go. There's gonna be two guys above. One is sleeping. One has the back turned on you. Because why wouldn't he? Make makes your job a lot easier. And you can take him out both with the uh, tomahawk. That's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to show you that you can also do this with any uh, throwable weapon. Whoops. Any throwable weapon. As long as it, it, the enemy doesn't spot the target that you killed, it's going to be fine. So, tomahawk to the, to the back. He's dead. And tomahawk to the face. There you go quick easy four kills there's no way you can mess this up so here on this on this section right here where there's only one guy uh, he's gonna spawn a uh, book on the road as soon as Lee go gets in position uh, you, you're gonna you're gonna actually see it right now like look right there and boop, there's a book there's a guy tomahawk to the chest he's dead and we're just gonna go collect our tomahawk back and now let's use some knife you can also take out this guy if you want I mean it's free XP mine as well right he's not gonna he's not gonna mess up the, uh, the mission so I mean it's 25 XP free just with with their backs on you so Right, on this section, you need to take out the guy that's moving around the thing, the little boxes. You take him out, then you take the guy leaning on the boxes, there you go. And then there's gonna be one guy next to the lake, river, whatever. You can also take him out, or not, you can ignore him, he's not gonna go anywhere, he's just gonna sit there with a lantern looking for something. But you know me. It's free XP, I'm gonna take it. Knife to the back. And loot the body. Get free execution and melee. Plus we get a silver buckle. Nice. Right, right now, right here on this final section, this is actually the last part of the section you need to take out two guys and you need to be mindful of where they are first you need to take out this guy right now he's gonna stop and then he's gonna move closer and this is when you can shoot him there you go perfect make sure to collect your arrows And also, you can take out the guy right there, the drunken guy. I don't know, I don't know about you. I normally take him out, still, free XP, but he's drunk, he's not gonna bother with you stealing the, the wagon. So basically, now that you have the wagon, it's just a ride to the destination, and you're gonna get a hefty amount of XP a little bit of cash and most importantly you're gonna get one gold bar point zero eight nuggets so it's really really good
This is the spot where you need to drop off the, the wagon. Whoa there. And one gold bar plus eight nuggets. Almost 2000 XP, $130. And that's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.